Hello guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel. If you are new and haven't subscribed our channel, press the subscribe button and bell icon button. In this video, we are going to do some reward exercise and we are going to make this part. You are assuming that this part is very difficult with lot of dimensions, but it is so much easy using revolve mode. So let's start. First of all, go to front plane, go to sketch and make a center line. This is also known as axis of revolution for us. Now what we will do, we will understand the dimensions. So this diameter is of 80. We are going to make this, this half part like this and we will revolve it to make the full part. So this is 80 mm dia and from here it is 60. So the distance, this distance is 10 mm because this is 40 and this is 30 so the distance between this is 10 mm so let's start we will make a point and give it the dimension of 10 mm now we will select the line and we will make the line of 40 mm there so Select the point, make the line, and give it give the line dimension of 40. So now our first line is ready. Now again go to the sketch, and you can see that it is continuously making the 40 mm lens. So our lens is always 40 mm, but our radius of these circles are different. Like you can see from here, first it is 40, then 55, then 70, and then total is 170. So we will see how we can do that. We will make the length of 40 and then the radius of 55. We will make the length of 40 and the radius of 55. Go to dimension and select this one. Now again make the line of 40 mm. Now our radius is 70 mm. Now we will again make the line of 40 mm. Now we will see that our dia is 170, so the radius will be 170 divided by 2. So it will be of 85 mm from the center line. So let's make it. So now make this line and gave it the dia of 85 from here. 85. So now you can see that the length is again 40 and the width is 8 from here so we will make 40 mm length line and now we will make the thickness of 8 mm now you can see that how much you have to go on the upside this dimension so this dimension we can check as our thickness is 8 mm so from here to here there is the 8 mm gap we will make the line and just give the gap of 8 mm just make the line and give the gap of 8 mm now again make the line now this time make this line and this line equal by selecting two lines Again, repeat the same step like this. Select the line and select end point and give it 8 mm. Now, again, make the horizontal line, select these two lines and give it the value.
now we will make this line again so now we will make this line now we will make this dimension and this from here to here it is 30 mm so we will give the value of 30 select the smart dimension and select this point to the center line and give it the value of 30 mm now we will make the line of 120 mm as you can see in this picture this line is of 120 mm so how can we know that it is 120 mm go to this shape and from here they have shown us that this is of 120 mm so we will make this line of 120 mm by giving the dimension from top to its end point 120 mm now we will drag it to 10 mm the point we have made and close the geometry so now our geometry is ready we will just select ok and go to the git sketch go to feature tab and go to reward boss base so you can see that our shape is ready so our model is ready but now we have to make this keyway slot as you can see this keyway slot so its length is 6 and its width is 3 so we will simply extrude cut by making the rectangle select this plane surface and draw the center line like this and select center rectangle give, give it the value of 3 and from here 6 go to exit sketch go to feature tab and select extrude cut and extrude it to 120 mm like this so our model is ready you can see if you want to see it in section you can just press this and you can just press this section view and you can make this of your choice like this and if you want to make other body as as transparent you can just select this transparent section bodies and select this body check ok button and now you can see the whole body and section body too so this was our tutorial on revolve exercise our next video will be on sweep boss base if you have any question just just comment on the video and tell us give us your feedback thank you for watching stay tuned for the more videos